It's really a delight to bring people out to discover this landscape. It's great. See, it's my office. It's cool. <laughs> Since 1872, volunteers of the Vosges Club have marked out and maintained more than 20,000 kilometers of paths to give access to all of the Vosges mountains. Munster cheese is known for its color, size and shape. You won't find a square, round or heart-shaped Munster. And then in terms of taste, I think the Munster is one of the best cheeses in our region. An autumnal dawn rises over the Rhine and the Alsatian slopes of the Vosges Mountains. Yannick, a mountain guide, didn't have to wait long to catch a glimpse of the chamois gathering sustenance. So here we are, at an altitude of 1,363 meters on the Onec Massif, and we're lucky to see some chamois refueling at the beginning of the day. Situated on the borders of the old French provinces of Lorraine, Alsace, and Franche-Comté, the Vosges Massif hosts a remarkable biodiversity. There's a diversity of landscapes that's quite remarkable between the slopes of Alsace and less steep hills of Lorraine. The fauna and flora are distinctive due to the weather conditions, which are extremely variable from one slope to another. There's also the people's culture, which is important. It's anchored in the region. The giant forest covers 60% of the mountain range, and a kilometer up, the pine trees disappear to make way for the beechwood. We're in what is called high-altitude beechwood, or the mountaintop beechwood. The particularity of these trees is that they have a trunk that is quite crooked and knotted like this. They're called twisted beaches. You can see it's having trouble acclimatizing to the weather conditions. Wind and the weight of the snow give it this configuration, a little concave, a little bit twisted. Luckily, these unique and diverse landscapes are not just reserved for the privileged few, quite the contrary. The peculiarity of the Vosges Mountains is that it's easily accessible by a multitude of hiking trails that allow us to discover the fauna and flora of these spectacular landscapes on the way. And families, groups of friends, school children, seniors and people with disabilities can all take these trails. The Vosges Mountain has an outstanding circuit of trails. It's managed and maintained by members of more than 120 local associations called the Vosges Clubs. It's an idea that we consider very important. We create the sites and maintain them, as our ancestors have been doing since 1872. The trails were created by the members of the Vosges Club, and they're maintained on a voluntary basis. Today, more than 20,000 kilometers of trails are signposted, and the whole system is refurbished regularly. They had the idea of installing signposts in the 1940s. Why? Because they had to find a way to enable people to navigate from A to B safely and in the best possible conditions. Throughout the year, 1,500 volunteers maintain the Vosges trails, like Jacques. There was a sign that was damaged, so I'm going to replace it on the trail. We have the largest amount of mountain-based abbeys and monasteries in France. The paths take you towards castles. All these trails are designed to bring hikers to the best viewpoints, so they can make the most of our local heritage. In the numerous farm inns that dot the mountain range, it's time to milk the cows and make the local cheese par excellence, Munster. I fell into all of this when I was small. My parents, my grandparents did this. As far back as I can remember, we always made Munster. Munster's unique taste is the result of how the cows are fed, on the grass of the Vosges Mountains. And only raw milk can transmit these qualities to the cheese. The taste of Munster comes in part from the raw milk. We work with the natural flora to be found around our farms, in the mountains, and in the feed. After molding or casting the cheese follows the ripening period of at least 21 days, which allows Munster's flavor and color to come out. 
Every two days, they are turned over and washed with salt water. It's this humidifying effect that gives the orange color to the Munster. It's a story of how the land is part of the natural heritage of the Vosges Mountains, from the cows to the meadows they're fed on, and the craftsmanship that turns it all into a world-renowned cheese. We showcase our local heritage. We make a point of highlighting all that you see around you, the beauty and richness of our landscapes, and above all, how we work with it. Whether you are with small children or with adults, the Vosges Mountains allow you to hike a few minutes, because it's really accessible, but there's also the possibility of roaming for days. 